Enough of a good thing. Mastering quantifiers in English. Hello, language learners. Today, we're diving into the exciting world of English grammar, focusing specifically on quantifiers. We've been exploring different quantifiers such as several, all, both. But today we're focusing on a very special one. Enough. This is a word that can be quite tricky to use correctly, but don't worry, by the end of this video, you'll have had enough practice to use it confidently. The word enough is a quantifier that means as much as is necessary or required. It can be used with nouns, adjectives, and adverbs, but the way we use it changes depending on the context. Remember, enough can refer to both quantities, countable and uncountable, and qualities. When we use enough with nouns, it comes before the noun. For example, I have enough money to buy a new phone, or there are enough cookies for everyone at the party. In these sentences, enough tells us that we have as much as is necessary or required of something whether it's money or cookies. Things get a bit tricky when we use enough with adjectives. Here, enough comes after the adjective. For instance, the soup is hot enough to serve or she is old enough to drive. In these cases, enough indicates the necessary level or degree of a certain quality, like being sufficiently hot or old. Finally, we can also use enough with adverbs. Just like with adjectives, enough comes after the adverb. For example, he doesn't work hard enough, or she doesn't study carefully enough. Here, enough is used to convey that someone is not meeting the necessary level or standard in how they're doing something. All right. That's all we have for you today on the topic of enough. Remember, when you use enough with nouns, it comes before the noun. When you use it with adjectives or adverbs, it follows them. Keep practicing, and soon enough, you'll be using enough with confidence and precision. Thanks for tuning in, and keep exploring the nuances of English grammar with us.